not everybody has that smooth even toned instagram routine but guess what nobody's talking about it so now we have a bunch of young girls and young guys thinking that their booty is not normal living with that insecurity of having bad acne bad pimples or bad rashes because we are really not talking about the fact that not all bums are initially smooth and even toned right from the get-go and the insecurity runs so deep that you're not comfortable wearing a bikini at the beach side or at the pool side or even in the bedroom Hello and welcome to 5 Minutes Wednesday where I provide quick but efficient solutions to everyday problems. My name is Inchua if you are new here and if you're returning, what's up my G? Welcome back to another video. In this video, we are discussing what rash, what acne, what pimple or whatever you choose to call it. People have them. If you're watching this, you're probably also trying to find the solution to this condition and I'm here to give it to you. First of all, what causes butt pimples or butt acne? First thing is wearing clothes that are too tight. If you're wearing underwear that is too tight, there's no air going to your bum. If you're wearing clothes that are polyester or spandex all day long all week long and there's not enough air going to that area you have a high chance of getting butt pimple or butt acne the second thing that may give you butt acne or butt pimple is sweating sweats from the gym sweats from walking around or sweats from doing any physical activity as long as you're sweating on your bum and you're staying there for extended periods it is very likely to give you butt acne or butt pimple the third thing is dead skin the very first thing is to let the booty breathe. Wear breathable underwear. If you have to go to the gym, so you're wearing a lot more spandex, make sure that the moment you're back from the gym, you're taking them off. You're not walking around all day long in your gym clothes or your gym leggings because that is not friendly on your butt. You can decide to sleep without panties at night so that your bum can get enough air and that will definitely reduce the chances of you getting butt acne. The second thing is to thoroughly cleanse your bum. Cleanse or treat your bum the same way you would treat your face. So apply a good amount of soap to your bum and cleanse it properly. Make sure that you're cleansing it very well. If you want to take it to another level, you can also use cleansers that you use for your face, for your bum, so that you can get rid of the already existing pimples and acne and black scars two times a day. And if you're particularly active or you go to the gym, the moment you come back from the gym, the first thing you're doing is taking your good shower and giving your bum a very good cleanse then make sure that you're exfoliating your bum exfoliating your bum will get rid of every dead skin it would open your pores up nicely and will give your bum that soft smooth feel that we all like and appreciate make sure that you're not using very harsh chemicals don't use what you won't use on your face on your bum you can also use chemical exfoliants for this purpose but make sure that you're exfoliating your bum at least once a week maybe two times a week you also have to remember that you're not supposed to exfoliate it every single day of the week because that may have negative effects on your booty then the next thing is to moisturize just as you moisturize your face make sure that you're having a good amount of moisture make sure that you're moisturizing your bum and moisturizing your bum you could use any moisturizers that are good for your face you use a good moisturizer if possible use a water-based moisturizer as opposed to using an oil-based moisturizer and you should do that immediately you step out of the shower because your body is ready and willing to absorb all the goodness you're giving it the moment you wait for too long after you step out of the shower your pores close and your body may not retain the goodness you're giving it so make sure that you're moisturizing the moment you step out of the shower and that will go a long way to deal with your bum rash or your bum pimple the next thing is to be patient and make sure that you're doing all these things for an extended period of time to be able to see results if you're doing it for a week and stopping because you're not seeing results then you're not really helping yourself so make sure that you're doing all these steps for an extended time and your bum will clear up nicely it can have all that smooth instagram booty that you want if you experience any discomfort when you walk in between your thighs as a result of your thighs rubbing i have the perfect solution to that as well right here in this video so check it out and I will see you over in that video.